Hello kittens! Silver here with Hunter the Pointer by Douglas Cuddle Toys and we have a package that arrived today and this in fact is going to be an alternate version of Hunter. This is the earlier version that we're going to open today which I've been searching for for quite a few months now. Um, typically I find with Douglas the earlier versions usually are superior and um, so we'll see if that holds true but this is actually from a friend of mine Akitas237 who has her own plush company called Prime Sheba so you guys should definitely check that out if you haven't already she has all kinds of amazing plush for sale for pre-order um, some secondhand plush which this one was um, so I'm really really grateful to have had the opportunity to to help support her and uh, to purchase this plush in particular from her. So I'm going to open this up now and I will stop drawing out the suspense. Okay, we have the package open and for some reason Hunter always looks so large to me. I, like, I'm like i thinking, I don't know why I'm thinking he's going to be smaller than, than what he actually is, but this is a good sized dog and I'm already seeing he's got the faux leather nose as opposed to this one with the plastic nose. Oh my goodness. I, I am so excited to see this guy. Hold on. Okay. So here we go. Here is the original Hunter. Oh my goodness. Look at his face. Oh my gosh. I absolutely love him. He's so, so cute. Oh my goodness. I love spotted dogs so much. Um, and Hunter is just, I think, the prime example of a pointer dog. He is so, so cute. And he's definitely, I would say, floppier than the, uh, than the second version of Hunter. He's a little bit more on the stocky side. Um, he stands up sort of well. I mean, his back legs do kind of fold. This one is, you know, kind of similar, I guess, in, in that regard. But he definitely has a lot more squish factor. His midsection is not nearly... As, uh, as highly stuffed as this one's is. And you can see this one also has a lot more spotting on his face and particularly up here on his forehead. Oh my goodness, he's so cute. You can see the difference too in the shapes of the muzzles. This one has a sort of, it looks like a longer and narrower muzzle. This one's a little bit rounder. So I think he's probably a little bit more accurate or breed accurate for a pointer. Uh, and he has really just look at those eyes they really are just prominent there's they're so big and and soulful looking let's see what if what else there's um what other differences there are between them so looks like he might have a little bit of a longer ear yeah his ear looks a little bit longer than this guy for sure um so of course everyone is going to have unique spotting patterns um so let's see this one has the spot here on the back sort of on the back right haunch and also one here at the top left shoulder. And this one, it kind of spreads all the way across. So you can kind of see how those two differ. Yep, definitely different spot patterns. So let me take a look too and see if he has a manufactured date. Oh yes, he does. So he was February, 2013. And let's see if this one has one too. Oh, it's all folded. It's probably not gonna work out so well. Oh, there we go. November of 2017, so there's a four-year difference between these guys. So you could definitely see where they made the design changes. Um, I'm typically of the belief that the earlier versions are, you know, usually superior. Um, they're both really, really nice dogs. So if you can get either one of them, I highly suggest you do so. Um, let me see. He also has the amber eyes. You can kind of see in the light there. This one does as well, so that looks... He almost looks like he has bigger eyes. Maybe it's just because the fur is concealing more of this one's. But I really love the, the fact that they use the pleather nose for this version. I always just feel it looks, I don't know, it looks a little bit more high-end, more realistic than the plastic nose. Um, but again, both really sweet pups. And I am so, so happy to have Hunter. So thank you so much again, Akitas237. I am, I am going to take excellent care of this guy. Oh, and it looks like we have a sticker here. I just noticed on my desk that somehow managed to escape my notice. But look at that. <laughs> that is so cute. It looks like a little Shiba Inu sticker. Uh, kind of a, <laughs> he's chomping at his back leg there. Oh my gosh, that is hilarious. So that is my Hunter Pointer, guys. I hope you enjoyed. And I'll be back again soon with some more plush goodness. Bye, everybody.